It's bright and early, guys, but when has that ever stopped me? This is Daz's Hot Comic Book Alerts, episode 399. Wow, nearly at the big 400. And I've got news about a pretty important character that is coming into season three of the Batwoman TV show. Yeah, the show is looking to add three new characters to its cast, but two of those are original characters. They have no comic book origins as such. So we're talking about that third character. And according to the Illuminati, the CW series is looking to cast a Latinx or Afro-Latinx actor in her 30s for the series' regular role. A former Gotham City Police Department GCPD officer who left the department due to the GCPD mistreatment of Gotham's marginalised citizens. Who is that character? Renny Montoya is now a paper pusher in charge of the Freaks Division at the Mayor's Office and she is dedicated to cleaning up Gotham's streets the right way. The other two characters that have been added, like I say, original characters, Jada Jett and Marquez. Now, created by Bruce Timm, Paul Dini and Mitch Brown, Renny Montoya first appeared in Batman the Animated Series as a beat cop. However, she eventually made her way into the comics in Batman issue 475. Exposed as a lesbian, she resigns from the GCPD and eventually becomes the question. Now, following the events of Convergence, she returned to the GCPD as Harvey Bullock's new partner. Her previous live action portrayals include Victoria Cartagen in Gotham. Love that show. And Rosie Perez in the DC Extended Universe film, of course, Birds of Prey and the Fantabulous Emancipation of One Harlequin. I've got an image of Renny Montoya from the comics. There we go, guys. So, I've just mentioned the issue, and it's a good one. From March of 1992, the first appearance of Renny Montoya comes in Batman, issue 475. A great Ventriloquist and Scarface cover. Like I said, Renny Montoya goes on to become the question. I paid four quid for this copy in February of 2019. I've had two or three of these. Now online, you're going to pay around about 20 quid for a copy. But I think it's a good investment because Ren Renny Montoya has been on screen several times and will continue to appear. I'm pretty certain of that. See what you can find eBay prices, we all know they're a bit crazy at the moment, so it's probably better to go dig in in those boxes. If you like what you see, like and subscribe. That's Daz over and out. Bye for now.